We are halfway towards Fortnite Season 4, Chapter 4, and we have brand new leaks about the new map update, Battle Pass skins, and all of the free awards you guys can claim before next season. So let's not waste any time and get straight into it. In my last video, I asked you guys to let me know if you guys knew the name of this emote, and here are the people who got it right. But if you guys do know the name of this emote, drop it in the comment section below, and I will hide your comments and put you in my next video. And remember, if you guys are picking up the Season 3 Battle Pass or anything in today's item shop, please do consider popping in my support credit code, Apple One as it does mean an absolute ton. So starting off, the new Elder Scrolls collab is now live also in the item shop where you guys can get the Nord Warrior outfit, which I actually really like. This skin looks super, super cool. You can then get the Ebonheart Battle Axe and the Ebonheart Battle Axe Bat Bling, but you guys can actually get this another way, which we're going to be showcasing in just a second. And you can also get the Nord Armor Wrap, which actually looks really, really nice. But you guys can actually get the Bat Bling for the skin for completely free. If you guys do download Elder Scrolls Online on the Epic Games Store, you will receive the signal of alliance war battling for completely free and if you guys do then go on to purchase the necrom dlc you will receive the battle axe pickaxe and battling when purchasing this dlc pack which i thought was really really cool but there is actually a way for you guys to receive a free 300 v bucks if you guys do download the elder scrolls on the epic game store and then download it again so twice it will actually refund you 300 v bucks onto your fortnite account as it thinks you've bought it twice but you can only do this once and you won't get banned for it so do not miss out on this because a free 300 v bucks is literally what everyone wants okay so we have quite a lot of people landed on me this is gonna be interesting wait how are you not dead here's his teammate knocked wait, is his other teammate oh no he's got a drum bro i'm on him I'm on a mission. But the brand new season three chapter four FNCS awards were decrypted a few days ago, showing a brand new bat bling, which actually looks really cool. Two loading screens, an emoticon and a free spray. But the bat bling will be available on the 20th of August by watching 15 minutes of the FNCS on Twitch. And the FNCS is currently going live right now as you guys are watching this video. So if you guys do want to unlock all of these free awards, make sure you guys are linking your Twitch account with your Epic Games account on the Epic Games website. It will be linked in the description below for you guys because these rewards, this season are actually really really cool but if you guys are struggling to get xp this season do not worry i have a crazy method for you guys with the new uefn maps only up is probably the best map you guys can play right now it is so fun and they've just released the chapter 2 version of it and from just playing four hours of only up you guys can get yourself over 500 000 xp which is a lot of levels to help you unlock all of the bonus styles and unlock optimus prime you do not want to miss out on this xp method because it's pretty overpowered oh we've got a guy up here oh, He's fighting the boss. I'm just going to take him out. Nice. I don't want to fight the boss. I really, I really don't. Wait, I'm going to come out for teammates. But they're getting peppered. Where are you getting shot from, bro? Oh. Well, that was easy. The 25.20 update has now been added to the staging servers, meaning it will be releasing next Tuesday with a ton of new free awards and items, starting with the unvolting of the Kinetic Boomerang. It's been vaulted for two weeks due to an issue, and it should be fixed very, very soon. So it should be getting unvolted. We also have the lever action pistol from the gameplay trailer that's still yet to get added this season, which I'm actually very excited for because this thing looks pretty good. So hopefully we do get to see that next update. But also in the trailer, you guys can see a new version of the last at the end on the key art which seems to be glowing blue which could be a glowing in different rarities depending on what loot is inside them so these should also be coming out next week we have a lot of cool things coming out so make sure you guys do not miss out on anything but the main thing you don't want to miss out on is a new version of fish sticks when fortnite showcase a new skin in the trailer it means it will most likely be coming out later that season and while there is a full muddy fish sticks inside of the trailer which could be a new skin arriving next week as we have just got a new trigger fish quest allowing you to unlock a new free spray so they could be teasing a brand new fish stick skin coming very very soon which honestly i think would be really really cool oh we got some guys there's one bro this mythic is pretty op oh there's another oh my god i'm bad oh 12 
Bro, I have no idea what's happening. Fortnite are now back from their vacation, meaning we'll be getting a ton of content, but it's already started with Epic Games already leaking Season 4 and some of the Battle Pass skins, which are actually really, really cool. A concept of a new member of the Lash reality that was originally supposed to come out in Season 7 called The General, but now looks to be coming out next season in the Battle Pass as a main skin for the storyline. You guys can see this skin looks so cool. It has four different styles, which upgrades each time, and I think the food style is definitely the best style, but it looks so, so cool and will be a main character for next season's storyline to bring back the last reality. But as we know from Chapter 3 Season 4, the scientist was taken by the last reality from the Chrome and has apparently been corrupted by them. And well, if you take the general and the scientist side by side, you guys can see they look too familiar. A bit too familiar, to be perfectly honest. Kind of scary, as they do have the exact same feet, the same knee pads, the same forearms, and the same helmet design, which could possibly be a corrupted scientist. As we've got an updated version of the paradigm, so Fortnite looks to be updating previous seven member skins, and this could be the brand new one, a corrupted scientist skin, which I think would be really, really cool. You guys can also see in this image here, he has chrome on him as well, which kind of does hint that it could be the scientist. We're going to have to wait and see, but it's honestly going to be so, so cool for next season's Battle Pass. So make sure you guys are on the lookout for him. But we also have new versions of the Cube Queen, hinting her return with the last reality, as we haven't seen her in a whole chapter, and she's supposed to be a huge part for the Fortnite storyline. And well, you guys know this chapter, we've had no storyline whatsoever. It's been pretty awful, to be honest. You guys can see her three new styles, which actually properly shows her face with a ton of upgradable customization features, which could indicate she's going to be the customizable skin for next season or possibly next chapter, unlocking new styles as the season progresses. You guys can see she also has a new pickaxe, which is dual wield, which I think would be really, really cool. Also, mask designs. Bro, this skin looks so fire. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys would like to see a brand new version of the Cube Queen, possibly coming out next chapter or next season, as well as the new general skin, which could be a corrupted version of the scientist. Oh, this is not good. I've got to push this guy. 20, bro. There we go. Um, this isn't good. I can't see him. I see him. Oh, yes. But next season, it looks like we're going to be getting a new desert biome as Fortnite has slowly started to tease it with adding a desert island on the edge of the map and Fortnite have actually added a new biome to the files including cacti, palm trees and Joshua trees being the new desert biome which is going to be really, really cool for next season. We haven't had a desert biome in about a year so I'm very excited to get this one back and it's possibly going to be very similar to Paradise Palms from Chapter 1 which I would love to see return being dragged to the island by the zero point like we saw in the Chapter 4 trailer or very similar to the condo canyon we saw in chapter three i'm actually excited for this desert biome let me know in the comment section below if you guys are as well but with next season being a volcanic season and a desert biome we have a ton of skin surveys that could be possibilities for next season's battle pass such as the volcanic jonesy skin who's been in the surveys for years now he should be coming out next season we also have this volcanic night skin which i think looks pretty insane and would make sense to be tier 100 next season or maybe even the secret skin but it's Secret skin could be this member of the last reality, as she does have these same symbols on her body as the brand new buildings around the jungle biome. And we also do have this new skin called the Explorer, which you guys can see she has the Queen's Cube in her hand, which means she is related to the last reality and they will sure be returning, which I'm very, very excited for. Oh, I think this is the last team. You're not that guy. There's another one there. I see him. It's a click skin. Right, not that guy. And there's one more over there, I'm pretty sure. Oh, this is teammate. There we go, baby. Easy peasy. That's how you do it. But that's everything in today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy it. Remember, if you guys are new, make sure you guys do hit that big red subscribe button. Season 4 is going to be a ton of fun. I'm super excited for it. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys have redeemed all of those free rewards. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.